Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is July 31st. <laughs> uh, it's last day of July, so it's last day of Christmas in July. Also, this is coming up really late. <laughs> like, some of y'all probably won't even see this until August 1st. But it's just because life was busy and we ended up going to a park earlier today after Dad got home from work. And we, you know, time just got away from me. <laughs> Anyways, I'm recording it now. It's like 10 o'clock my time. So by the time I edit it and all that, it's going to be probably tomorrow. <laughs> but anyways, this is my last ornament that I'm uh, participating in collab with Kim the Crafty Nomad and Terry over at Your Joy Podcast, plus a bunch of other people have joined in since. So uh, here goes. This is my last ornament. <laughs> and also, I do want to say about the giveaway. The giveaway does end tonight, so it'll probably be over by the time you watch this. But uh, all the people who entered via Facebook and through email, I will be drawing the winners maybe tomorrow, but it might be a little bit later in the week when I get a moment to sit down and on do all that. Uh, and then I'll be announcing those winners in a video, so stay tuned for that. But anyways, my last ornament is a cute one, and uh, or of course, you know, I'm biased, I made it, <laughs> but I happen to love the image of this, and one of my favorite Christmas songs is this. <laughs> but it is a free YouTube tutorial, and the YouTube channel is called Amigurumi underscore Joy. Joyce, maybe? Joyce? I don't know. I'll link it below and the tutorial. They've got a bunch of video tutorials and they don't really have a whole lot of views. Most of their videos have way under, like under a thousand views, but um, they're really nice tutorials. I followed this one along. There was one little typo in one part of it, but it was just about how many times you repeat something. But that's all I noticed. And um, anyways, I'll show you the pattern. Are you ready? Ta da! <laughs> oh, it's a little shaped and I accidentally put the jog from the where you finish off in the front but this is for my own personal use and I did add jingle bells but I made silver bells uh one of my favorite Christmas songs is silver bells and there's also a a Hallmark movie called silver belt silver bells <laughs> that I always loved watching it's about this boy who um his family owns like a tree farm I'm pretty sure like a Christmas tree farm and he wants to be a photographer so he like goes into the city <laughs> like most Hallmark movies you know they're all based in like the country country people going to the city or city people going to the country one of the two <laughs> um and he takes a picture of like an architectural bells on like a, a building somewhere and enters a contest and anyways it's just really good he ends up getting kind of famous off of his picture uh and he gets people like into the holiday spirit you know it's one of those feel good movies anyways it's a good movie and i love the song silver bells um and yeah so you make it it's in four parts technically there's two bells this little um it's just like two rows and then the bow the, the main part of the bow but the tutorial shows you how to make the bells and the bow does really good like step instructions on how to do all the bow part mine's a little curly but i don't really mind so i'm going to put like a little hook on here and i did i just added these on my own it's not part of the tutorial this is actually my beginning um end where you make your magic ring i just put two little jingle bells on each of them and tied it on there so it's just a little jingle belly <laughs> But I just think it's cute as heck. The yarn that I used, this is a, um, I'm trying to think of what it's called. It's Bernat Soft Gray. And this is, um, Bernat also. It's one I got recently. No, maybe it's Big Twist. I don't know. It's red. <laughs> but that's it. I used a D hook, actually. It called for a 3 millimeter, and I grabbed a 3.25 millimeter. So I used a D hook and I liked the way it came out. I, I tried to put those in the back and then they somehow got twisted as I was sewing the bow on. But like, you know, I don't really mind because it's my own little decoration. But I think it's so cute. So I'll leave that link down below for you guys to check it out if you want to. Um, and yeah, so that's the last uh, ornament. So Christmas in July is over, but now Vlogist is starting. <laughs> and then all the spooky stuff now is all Halloween. -y. <laughs> um, but uh, I will draw the winners, like I said, and release them sometime this week. The video will be labeled Christmas in July winners. So um, there'll be four, two from each category, two from the ornaments and two from the gifts. And uh, I got, there's, you can't see it because I got all stuff stuffed in there, but the, the notion pouches and stuff are back there. I do have to finish getting the um, stitch markers. I made them, but I got to put them on little cards. I haven't done that yet. <laughs> I need to do that. But then I will mail them out to you guys uh, as you claim your prizes. <laughs> but anyways, I'm going to hop off here and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye.